Tomorrow marks a full week since Governor Walls shut down schools across Minnesota. And while school isn't in session, teachers and students came together this afternoon in Stewartville to show each other that they're not only missed, but appreciated as well. If you heard honks, cheers, and music around Stewartville Tuesday, so I reached out to our music teacher. It's all because of one kindergarten teacher. And said, um, this is a good way, I think, to show them that we support them, that we want to still continue to have that relationship and connection with our students, um, but also keeping our distance. A parade. I just saw this idea on Facebook of some schools down south that had started it. With a route and message that stretched across the city. This is a time for everybody to stop and appreciate. And so, yep, we appreciate our kids, but it feels good to have the community say that back to us. We definitely miss the teachers as much as they do, if not more. And so I totally understand. I know that um, the second grader here particularly is very um, involved with friends mm -hmm. and really likes what they do at school. Bonner does just a really great job at engaging kids, and they really just miss it. Which is why it should come as no surprise that just shy of 100% of the staff from both elementary schools took part in, quote, an awesome parade. And when you've been in the district for a long time, it's not only my kids that I'm going to see this year, my students that I currently have, but it's my kids from previous years that that relationship never goes away and you get to watch them grow up. And so you, you miss them too. It's the other kids from other classrooms that you want to say hello to in the hallway and you don't get to anymore during this time. So this parade is going to be awesome. In Stewartville, <laughs> Blaze Keller, ABC 6 News. Oh, we feel you, teachers, and we miss you, too. Well, they're back again, this time with a different tune.